Hi guys, it's Dustin, and I don't know if you guys know this, but I love filling up a lot of my wall space in my room, especially with memories because I'm a nostalgic little bitch. This can include anything from posters to art prints, stickers, Polaroids, film photos, and much, much more. I am super nosy and love knowing every detail of someone's room, and I know you guys probably are too because you always ask where my wall decor is from. So here is a tour of everything on my walls. Starting on this side, on the left I have a receipt from in and out I like saving receipts as mementos sometimes if I'm having a night out with friends or something. This Catch Some Rays sticker which is very Californian of me. I really do love living in California I guess. You'll notice I have a lot of stickers on my wall. This art print which I actually have multiple from the same artist. This little picture from one of my favorite Studio Ghibli movies, Whisper of the Heart. Polaroids of my friends and I from a sleepover. I put Polaroids everywhere. This vintage car poster is actually from a vendor at my local flea market. He sells vintage items such as magazine pages and ads and this is one of them. Every time I go to the flea market I like to check out his booth and it's now to the point where I am a regular and he remembers me. He's actually really cool he always gives me discounts I love my vintage vendor and I have these postcards from LACMA. Really anything that has a memory or holds any nostalgic value I will consider putting on my wall. Moving on to my door I have some old sketches taped on there I actually don't do art or draw too often anymore I'm just way too busy and never have time and I thought maybe displaying a few sketches would inspire me to do so again. Above my door, I have some more vintage ads slash posters. I have some old family photos, this Mars poster that I got from Society6, and along here I have some film photos of my friends and I to remind myself, hey Dustin, you have friends, you are not alone, so stop being sad because in reality it's just 3am and you're overthinking. On my mirror, I have some butterflies that I painted, and above that, I have my Studio Ghibli collage wall, and I actually got all of these from a Studio Ghibli postcard set. I color-coded it and everything, and I love Studio Ghibli so much, so this wall makes me super happy. Moving on, I have these string lights hung across this wall. This world map poster I actually got from a Japanese stationery store, but you can pretty much get these posters from any other stationery store or art store. And then I have another variety of different things here. I have this Jasmine Dragon art print from Starfruit Press Co. Because as you guys know, I am obsessed with Avatar The Last Airbender. This mirror is from the Target dollar section. And right next to that, I have my mini collection of pressed pennies. Last thing here I want to talk about is this very rare, very vintage Viner sticker. Catch me selling it on Depop. Remember when I said I have Polaroids everywhere? Yeah, I literally meant everywhere. Over here I have some more posters. I got the succulent poster from the same place I got the map poster. And as for the bike and honey poster, I got them at a random art supply store in Santa Cruz. This is a little watercolor painting I did. And I have this art print from Matthew Sorge. I really love his artwork so much, especially his choice of color palettes. Then to the right, I have some of my favorite film photos I've taken, and then going to above my bed, I have this frame photo that I thrifted, and another random compilation of art prints, stickers, and memories. In this very last section here, we have this celestial chart poster, which I know, I know, Conan Gray vibes! I swear people be taking one look at this poster and they think I'm practically in Conan's room, and to that I say... Sure. Right under that I have my collection of movie stub tickets because I think they make good mementos and I like to look back and remember on past films I've seen. And that is the end of the tour. I hope this inspired y'all and helped answer any questions you guys had. If you have any more questions, feel free to leave them in the comments and I'll try my best to respond. And that's it. So, I'm a go. Oh. <sighs> Pack it up, Coraline. Or is this something I <laughs>